Hi there, everybody. The Mendota Heights police chief is telling people to stay inside, lock their doors. They're searching for a suspect who is considered armed and dangerous. This all started this morning, and what started as the search for an armed robbery suspect has turned into a manhunt and murder investigation. Ivory Hecker joins us live now. Ivory, any information on the victim? Well, Camille, there is no, no word so far on her identity or why she was inside the building behind me when she was killed. Actually, the police chief did just come up to the tape here and I spoke with her. Uh, she says that right now police and other investigators are working to process three crime scenes and I'll show you them right behind me. The first one is actually a swamp in the woods back there where the suspect crashed his car while fleeing from police. He then police say he then entered this senior center. You see with the pointy roof there uh, and that senior center is the place that went on lockdown after he crashed his car. Police say they believe the suspect then went into the Mendota Heights Business Center here where they later found a woman dead. They do believe that that woman was killed by the suspect. Her body was found by police after they had evacuated the senior center, thinking the suspect could still be inside. Now, police say it started around 9 a.m. this morning with an attempted armed robbery at a home uh, just down the street on Highway 110. The suspect then sped down the road to this business area where he crashed his car in the swamp. The police chief says, the suspect is described as an Asian man armed with a gun. Right now, police are following several leads on his whereabouts, and the police chief is urging people in the area to stay alert and cautious. We're asking that people stay inside, lock their doors. If anybody strange comes to their door, uh, please call 911 immediately. We did notify the golf courses, had them pull the people in off the course. And the police chief says that so far they're not sure if this suspect is on foot or in a car. As we said, his car is in the swamp right now, so they wouldn't know which car that would be. The BCA is assisting with this investigation, and the police chief says she's hoping to have a better description of the suspect soon. Back to you guys. All right, well, thank you so much, Ivory.